Yo yo, what's going on guys, your boy Dino, welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video we've got a solo money glitch for you guys, yes solo, a solo card duplication glitch to be exact. Okay, now this video was gone ahead and made by Obese Giraffe, so check his link, his link will be in the description. Uh, check him out, subscribe to him and all that stuff, right? Before we do get into it, hashtag notification squad baby, you know what it is, and today's shout out goes to you bro, thanks for being part of the hashtag notification squad. If you guys want a shout out just like this, go ahead and turn your notifications on for this channel, drop a like on today's video. Be as early as you can and put a hashtag notification squad comment in the comment section. I might screenshot that and put it in the next one. Alright, so let's move on into it. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and buy as many uh, LEGs as you want. So if you're going to duplicate three cars, buy three. If you're going to do five and so on and so on, you know what I mean? So uh, buy them and pull them out of your garage and destroy them, okay? So once you've destroyed them, go ahead and pull your uh, assault and arrest out and your mobile operation center out. Inside that mobile operation center you will have your assault and arrest like you see here with personal vehicle storage and what we will be doing is going ahead, this works for the Xbox as well as the PlayStation 4 okay. So what you want to do is go ahead and go up to the car, once you click triangle or Y to get in the vehicle you want to go ahead and hold down halfway the acceleration button or the reverse button okay so LT or RT whatever it is or R2 or L2, hold it down a little bit so halfway and you want to hold the pause button as well okay so I'm going to slow it down right here as you see I'm getting the vehicle holding that LT or RT and I'm holding this pause button and what you want to do is you want to go ahead and when your car starts up and starts to reverse you want to let go of both of them okay and it should be on the screen just like this so if you're not on a screen like this uh, just keep on doing it until you get a screen like this and you should eventually spawn outside your MOC on foot, okay? Now if you don't spawn outside on foot, um, if you spawn in the car, that means you've done it a bit slow or you've done it a bit too fast or something like that, okay? So you've got to go back in and do all the steps again. Like I see here, uh, go into the car, hold LT or RT halfway down and hold the options or pause button. Let go of them just before you drive out the vehicle and you should be on driving out in the black screen with the pause menu up. Like I said before, you should then go ahead and spawn outside your mobile operation center on foot, okay? So like, again, if you're not on foot, do the steps again. So go ahead and um, get into your vehicle and hold the LT and RT until you do go ahead and spawn out, okay? And if you do spawn out on foot and your glitch is working so far, uh, go ahead and register as an MC president. And what you want to do is go ahead and request any sort of motorcycle in your uh, from your interaction menu, okay. So from your motorcycle club, uh, as you see on the map right now, the vehicle, the, the bike will go ahead and flash on the mini map. That's fine so far. Uh, once you've done that, you want to go ahead and request it once again. Okay. So so far so good. Uh, once it's requested and it spawns near you somewhere, so go ahead and return it back to storage. And then what you want to go ahead and do is bring up your interaction once again. Go to mobile operation center and repair. Uh, re request personal vehicle from there okay you can't go into it and get it like that to request it once you request it once it's been delivered to you go ahead and pull it out and take it to your garage now I recommend using this garage right here um, it's next to the Morris Mutual de uh, Depot and next to the Simeon garage or Simeon um, workshop okay like I said before you don't need to have this garage but I recommend using it because it's the closest to Simeon dealership and the Morris Mutual Depot Okay, so once you've taken it into your garage, all you want to go ahead and do is head over to your MOC and park it just like I do in the gameplay. This is for the reason because we will, when we're doing the duplication glitch, we will be going into the back of the uh, mobile operation center and getting on the front cannons and destroying our vehicle that we request back in. I'll have more information about that later on in the video. Basically, this is what you got to do. Okay, so park the mobile operation center like this in the gameplay. So it's uh, the um, this location that we're parking it right now is over here by the Simeon dealership and the Morris Mutual is down the road by the depot even. So park it like that and then from there you should be sorted. Pretty awesome. Okay, so thumbs up to that then. What you want to do then is go back to the garage where your vehicle or where your Salt and RS is actually indeed uh, stored. And then what you want to do is head over to the TV, okay? Now just go into the TV by clicking right on D-pad or whatever it is and then what you want to do is scroll through there until you come across or scroll right on the, the uh, D-pad until you come across 
uh, expectating player, okay? Now, I forgot to say this before, you've got to be in a public session, I completely forgot about this, you've got to be in a public session with more than 18 people. Well, it's, it's, it works easier with more than 18 people, okay? So once you're on the TV, go ahead and spectate a player, then go once to the left, and you should be on the screen right here. And what you want to do is from there, when you're on the TV, is blow up your phone and start up a heist uh, job and go on call. So make sure it's on call. So you see it says it says locating jobs at the bottom right. Once that's literally about to say joining job or something like that, you want to go ahead and spam right on the D-pad. Okay, now this part is you need to have this part. Okay, so if you don't get this part with the um, TV options in the bottom right, you need to do that bit again. Okay, now like I say, well, this is a difficult. Uh, this could actually, you know, if you from this part, there's some like little steps you need to follow now. Um, it could after this part now, it could actually freeze. Okay, so if it freezes, um, you gotta go ahead and do it again. Okay, but if you, you go if if you don't if you go into the mission if you go into the sky without the options, and uh, make sure you leave as fast as you can. Okay, because you don't want to have the host start of the mission because this will reset the whole glitch again. You have to do it all over again. And we don't want that. Okay, so. Again, if you're going to go into a mission, if you don't do it correctly first time, you know, I spam right on the D-pad after you use a TV, just um, back out the mission as fast as you can before that person starts up the heist mission because that will actually ruin the glitch that we've done so far, which is kind of gay. So, again, before, watch out for that. And, uh, yeah, you should be in a sky like this, okay? So, if you're in a sky like this, in the options button, go left on the D-pad once to go back to spectate and player. And then once you're back on a spectating player, like you see in the gameplay, just go ahead and click B to get off the TV and sh run straight over to your Sultan RS. And what we want to do is go ahead and drive this over to our MOC, which is parked by Simeon dealership. Okay, now you'll notice on the bottom left hand corner there is no minimap. If that is no minimap for you, that means your glitch is working completely fine. Now the reason for me I say I have this apartment. Is for the MOC to be closer because between now when you jump out the TV, get into the car, and go to your MOC, you could get an alert uh, error message. Okay, now unfortunately we didn't we, well, we didn't get it in the gameplay, but this could actually happen to you. Um, you need to do it again if it does happen to you. Okay, so basically I recommend using that garage right there. Once you're outside of it and you and your RS or assault and RS, go to your mobile operation center, get out the vehicle, and return personal vehicle to storage. Okay. From there, run into the mobile operation center. And once you're inside there, you will see another Sultan RS. All you want to go ahead and do is go to um, your internet, and uh, you want to go ahead and go to Warstock, and then you want to go ahead and buy Bay 2 as weapon and vehicle uh, vehicle workshop. Okay, and this will cost like a 955,000 or something like that. Ridiculous, but. Uh, once you've done that, you'll have like a black background, which will be all right for like a couple of seconds, and you will spawn in the weapon and vehicle workshop. Okay. Now from there, all you got to do is go ahead and wait for your uh, mechanic guy to spawn in, and then what you want to do is get into the Sultan RS and change the number plate, and then change the color or something like that. If you, want, if you like the color, just change the number plate and then change it back if you want it back to the same color it was. But then, simply from there, all you want to go ahead and do is bring up your phone, go to Morris Mutual and request um, an allergy. So bring up your phone, go to Morris Mutual Insurance and go to the car you blew up and request it. So ours is an allergy RH8. Then from there, get into your Sultan RS, change the plate like I said a minute ago, or change the color, doesn't really matter. Once you've changed that color, get out of the vehicle by going to exit vehicle only. So what I mean by that is it'll give you two options, exit vehicle and workshop, don't do that, or just exit vehicle, click exit vehicle. As you see here we change the plate or we change it back, it doesn't really matter which one you have, just change it around, change the colours or change something on the vehicle and exit vehicle only, okay? Once you've exited vehicle only, all you want to go ahead and do is run to the gunner seat which is found at the front of the uh, the MOC, get into the front gunner and blow up the uh, the RH8 in front of us. So as you see, it's right here. All you want to go ahead and do is destroy it. Once you've destroyed it, all you want to go ahead and do then is back out, bring up your phone, 
Good insurance. I should be in there as well. So you got two now. And again, continue the same steps. Get into the vehicle, change the plate, get back out, run back to the gunner, blow the vehicle up, and then come out of that. Bring up your phone, sorry. And then um, go to your Morris Mutual. And then it should be a salt and arrest once you've blown it up. So that is it for the video right there. If you guys did enjoy this, let me know what you think of this glitch in the comment section. Let me know over Twitter. Follow me on Twitter as well. Link will be in the description. If you guys are new, don't forget to turn on post notifications on my channel because we do upload every single day, bro. I'm talking money glitches, modern dive tutorials, you name it, we do it. But other than that, guys, that's it for today's video. If you did enjoy, you know what to do. Turn your notifications on, drop a like, and I'm your boy Dino, and I'll see you next one. Peace.